Ozark bait and tackle. Kyler Beckman's inside talking right now, so I'm a little late. We gotta hustle up, see what's in here. Now, the main thing to find fish this time of the year is you gotta find shad. I mean, it's very, very important. Some of the best places in the world is, you know, creek channels, go back to the creeks, um, large coves, but if you don't see shad on your electronics, turn around and head on to the next one. You have to find shad. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Monday afternoon, Lake of the Ozarks. I'm with Kyler Beckman here, and uh, today, I got some new rods in the mail. Also, I got some new baits to tie on, but we actually were out yesterday afternoon. The bite was eh, it was okay. Not enough for a video, but today's goal is to catch some big crappie, pound and a half to two pound fish, some big pre-spawn females. That's the goal today. We're gonna be spider rigging. All right, let's get up front and I'll walk you through the setup. So just like Kyler said in the beginning of the video, you gotta find the shad to find the crappie, and that's just what we did. We headed from the boat ramp to the nearest cove that we could find, and sure enough, we found schools of shad and suspended crappie right in the middle of the cove. The new rods I've been talking about are the 16 foot trolling rods by ACC Crappie Sticks. Instead of a double jig setup, we actually tied on a Aberdeen hook on the top hook and hooked mint live minnows and used plastics on our bottom hook. It is 12 foot and right now, just kind of starting out, we got bait scattered from about two foot below the surface to right off the bottom. Just trying to figure out where these big ones want to feed at. Get him. Got that one. Big one. Top hook though. Oh. A little more, a little closer to what we're looking for anyway. Yeah, just set it on the trolling motor I'll get in a second. Fish area, he didn't, didn't let go of it, did you? How deep was she? Uh, probably seven, six, seven feet down. That's probably what my top one is. Hold on, I'll show you. I'll, ball, I'll ballpark it here. I'm, I'm like that. I like that. She ate on the top. She's in the minnow, so seven feet maybe. Yeah. Wasn't no missing that bite, was there? Mm -mm. She just took it. Yeah, it's not that big, but no, it's a lot bigger than what we <laughs> what we have been catching. What we've been looking at. I got it. I got it. I got it. Copy number three on the plastic. So far, the big ones have been come off the the minnows, though. All right. Yep, that one. Good one. Oh yeah, need that. Got it. In the boat. Yeah. There's a nice Missouri fish. We're looking for a bigger one than that, though. We want a two pounder. That's a good start to the day. How big you think that is? Pound and a quarter? Mm, probably just under a pound and a quarter. Five. You got another one? Yeah, I had one. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Yeah, we're definitely going through the school. All right, Mr. Catfish. Oh, we hit the plastic. I hate how their mouths are so gosh darn hard. Got all that fat or something in them. And yeah. There we go. It's gonna be pretty difficult to get a hook out of sometimes. Ugh. See you, buddy. Net? Yeah, I'm not building it up actually. Oh, 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 there we go. Pretty nice one there. Pretty nice 
I don't think there might be a little shower. Huh? I think there might be a little shower. Yeah. I think this is a different fish. <laughs> I'm almost positive that's a different fish. Because I think the bottom will hit the plastic. You did. Actually, I'll let you yep, do it yep. and I'll get the camera. Another really good, like the Ozarks fish. What do you think that one weighs? About a pound and a quarter. Pound and a quarter. Yep. Minnows and Aberdeen hooks. Getting it done. <laughs> that was completely my fault. 100%. Big fish too. Oh wow, look at that. Cool. That's easy. Well, that's not so easy because it got tangled. There we go. Good? Uh, no, that's a decent it's fish. Eating but, fish. Yeah, eater for sure. Get over here. I got him. I got him. This is a fun fight. <sighs> Gotta love catfish. Rip Norton Drag now, wasn't he? Uh-huh. Oh, 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 oh. I'm not recording. <laughs> I got her, I got there her. There we go. <laughs> got, her. got her. Got her. Hook came right out. Nice fish. Picture fish. Big one. Oh, that's a big cat. You let it go or you still got it? Oh, I still got it. Big old catfish. Oh, the joys of spider rig and union net. Nah. You got him. Just calm the hell down here for a second. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna give him a break and got him. This is the fun part of spider rigging right here. Catch one of those ugly guys. Alright. There he is, nice fat cat. Finally got our Lake of the Ozarks bass. A little black and chartreuse, getting it done. I know. About well, six inches underneath the water. Nine inch fish? Oh yeah. Sure. Gotta be ten though, right? To keep Nine. Oh you gotta be ten. God dang. <laughs> Crap. 
Oh no. <laughs> Third line. Oh God. Third line. Oh God. You stupid, don't get my fourth. Don't get in my fourth, please. Stupid catfish. <laughs> well, that might be the day. Oh, gosh dang it. Man, that's... That's shitty. <laughs> gosh dang it. I hate these. I officially hate these fish. Yeah, right oh. yeah, we got a lot of these big healthy catfish here on like the Ozarks. Yes, we, yes you do. And I hate them all. This is another cat. Sure as heck is. Oh, he let it go. Thank goodness. Well, that's a big one. That's a good one. Huh? Oh, and he broke me off. That's, that's what he did. <laughs> yeah. He broke me off. I got to retie all my rods. Well, I don't know if I caught all that, but uh, yeah, I just had two catfish. The first one took it, ran through th my other two lines, and then I just had another catfish break me off. So all four of my rods, gone. Got to retie done. all of them. The joys of spider rigging. Well, that's going to wrap it up for today. I can't even see anything. We're in the sun. But that's going to wrap it up for today. Thanks again, Kyler. Got some nice fish on spider rigging with the live minnows this time. Last time it was just plastics. Yep. Be sure to go follow Kyler on Instagram and check out his YouTube channel below. Uh, guide service coming soon. Yep. I'll link that, his website below when it comes out. So yeah, that's gonna wrap it up. Live Minnows and Spider Rig, appreciate you watching. Be sure to click that subscribe button, click that bell, and like the video. We'll see you next time.